Please don't forget to like this video and if you haven't done so already, click the subscribe button, then click the bell and then click all. Every like and subscribe helps us make more great videos for you. This guide shows you how to uninstall Windows Fax and Scan on Windows 10. Now, most people nowadays have their own scanning software that comes with their printer and they don't actually use their computer as a fax machine. So really there's no point in having that software installed. So here's how you remove it. All you do is click on the start button, then click on the settings cog. And then when this menu appears, go to apps, click on apps, then click on optional features and then scroll down this list here until you get to Windows Fax and Scan. Left click once and then move your mouse over uninstall and left click once and Windows Fax and Scan will then be uninstalled. Now it says if I scroll up to the top there that a reboot is required. So I'm just gonna reboot the machine. So all I do to do that is click on the start button, click on power, and then click on restart. It will probably say preparing to configure Windows. Do not turn off your computer. Just wait for this to go through and the computer will eventually restart. Okay, so Windows has now restarted and it's fully uninstalled. But what happens if you decided later on that you wanted to reinstall Windows Fax and Scan? Well, all you do is just click on the Start button, click on the Settings cog, and then when this screen appears, go to Apps, then click on Optional Features, and then go up to Add a Feature just up there and scroll down to where it says Windows Fax and Scan, which uh, is quite a way down here. So there you go, there it is, Windows Fax and Scan. Just put a little tick check mark just in the box, just to the left of it, and then click Install. And Windows Fax and Scan will start installing. Now this bit might take a bit of time, just have a bit of patience with it. Hopefully it won't be very long. Okay, so as you can see, it's been about three or four minutes and uh, it's still installing, but it's nearly finished. And there we go, it now says installed. So once it's installed, we can just click on the cross just up here and Windows Fax and Scan will be back on our system. And there we go, I've just searched for it in the search bar and there it is. So there you go, that guide showed you how to uninstall and reinstall Windows Fax and Scan on Windows 10. Hope this guide helps and thank you very much for watching. You can follow me on Twitter at CWTech, that's at CWTech on Twitter. And don't forget to check out my other videos in my YouTube channel, just Google Chris Waite YouTube. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you for your support.